Good morning, everybody. Today I'm at the uh, Halls Creek Trail. Just rode my bike in. It's the uh, last week of September, and I'm here to shoot the fall colors. And as you can see, there's plenty of color around here. Uh, we've had some rain lately, so I'm hoping there's uh, lots of water in the brook. So uh, let's go for a little walk. Okay, so I found my first shot. It's these uh, cattails. And I know I said I came out here to get fall colors, so if I just uh, swing around here off in the distance, you can see these colorful trees. As a subject themselves, they're kind of far away and there's not a whole lot going on. So what I've done, I've lined the camera up so the, uh, the color of those trees back there is directly behind these cattails. And using a shallow depth of field, I'm just using the trees as a soft colored background and the actual subject is the uh, cattail. So this is what it looks like on the back of the camera and I'll put the, uh, the final shot up on screen now for you. Well, it seems to have clouded over a bit, but uh, still a gorgeous morning for a walk so we're just going to keep looking around uh, it's a nice soft light so might be good for some close-ups it's hoping to maybe spot a few mushrooms they always make for interesting photos uh, anyways what a great day So after stopping for a little coffee break, the sun has come out again, and I've found my next shot. Uh, I'll show you the, the how I have it framed in a minute, but basically I'm using these two trees here and this fallen over birch to frame the shot. And because there's still some cloud in the sky, the sky is kind of bright, so I'm getting my colors actually down here in the water. Uh, just waiting for the sun to come out a little bit more and then I'm gonna take the shot. So I managed to find some mushrooms and pretty simple shot, just down low, uh, handheld, focus right on the mushroom. Pretty slow shutter speed, but I've got the image stabilizer on. The Lumex GX8 has this flip-up viewfinder, and this is fantastic for low-angle photography. With a normal camera, I would be, I'd have to be on my belly trying to see this shot. So I found another group of mushrooms and uh, I shot this one uh, before I started filming because uh, the sun was shining right on the mushrooms and I didn't want to lose the light. So basically it's pretty simple, just set the camera up low, focus on the mushrooms, background's out of focus, the mushrooms are brighter than the background so there's a nice separation and pretty simple shot really. So I'm hiding in the bushes for my last shot here. I'll just swing the camera around, show you what I got going on. I have these ferns in the foreground and some nice color in the background. Uh, I've taken a few variations of this. I'm just going to take another one right now uh, because the, the sun keeps coming and going. That beeping that you're hearing, that's the uh, two second timer. Um, I could use a cable release. Uh, to eliminate camera shake or just using the two second timer after I push the button if there's any camera movement uh, It'll stop by the time the shutter fires So let's take one more for safety Glad you stuck to the end and uh, hope you enjoyed it and uh, Thanks for watching